So hello again, and this time we're on the island of Staffa, about an hour by boat from uh, the Isle of Mull. Um, so we're quite, we're quite far out at sea, but Staffa is a remarkable island. Um, it has these amazing basalt blocks, as you can see in the hill, um, that's completely made out of, of basalt just, uh, just in front of us. And um, it, it's a truly remarkable island. I mean, not only has it got these, uh, these basalt blocks everywhere, but also just around the corner it has um, it has a legendary Fingal's Cave. Now, Fingal's Cave is uh, is a sea cave. It's a it's a cavernous cave, and um, you know people come here to photograph it quite regularly. Sadly, this year, following a, a storm over the over the winter period, um, there was a collapse in the cave, and uh, you can no longer gain access. But uh, here's a picture that I took of uh, Fingal's Cave on a, on a, my visit last time. As you can see, it's uh, it's an amazing uh, cave with with lots of different colours, and, and the water flows right into it. And uh, of course, this is where Mendelssohn created his, uh, his composition, Fingal's Cave, um, uh, back in the 1800s sometime. So today we're going to photograph some, some other things around the cave. And these basalt blocks here in this hill uh, make, a, make a logical place to start. So as we can see, we've got, uh, we've got the sea running between us and this basalt island. And uh, the aim here is to get the sea, kind of nicely smooth that sea out with a, with a, with a, with a lee. Um, neutral density filter, we're going to use the big stopper today. And then um, trying to capture the detail of that, of that basalt blocks and, and the formation and the way it sort of sweeps around from one side to the other. So let's, let's give that a go and see what happens. So on the front of this camera here, obviously we've got a smaller tripod because I'm traveling a little bit today. I want to keep it a little bit light, but I've still got my, uh, my Nikon D850. I'm using my 24 to 70 2.8 lens. Obviously I could go wider with a, with a 15 to 30, but 20, 24 70 is the one to use today. And uh, on the front of that lot, I have got a polarizing filter just to cut out a little bit of glare on the water and, uh, and bring a bit of definition to the sky and uh, a lee big stopper that's going to give me an exposure of about 30 seconds i'm shooting at f14 and i'm shooting iso 64 so let's take that picture and see what it looks like clearly when we do this we need to remember to put our camera didn't do that i'll just click it around now hopefully it won't make a difference and um, put our camera uh, viewfinder so that uh, it's blanking off all the light if you haven't got if you haven't got one of these blanking things just use a bit of blue tack or a blanking plate um, and the focus has already been locked and loaded and set to manual so that the the, 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 the auto focus system on the camera doesn't really start to focus and move backwards and forwards through the uh, through the frame now this frame i hope we should have that uh, that mound on the kind of left hand third of the image and those sweeping lines on the right, just kind of sweeping up to create a bit of a leading line to the top of that mound. There's nothing on top of the mound. It'd be great if there was, maybe a cormorant or a, or a big bird or something, maybe an eagle sat there, but we haven't got that today. Um, so we, we have what we have, uh, but it's, hopefully it should be a quite a pleasing image. Okay, that's about done. Let's have a look at that image. Yep, we've, we've kind of succeeded in what we wanted to do. It's a bright sunny day. We're not going to get the most amazing photographs. And it's really, really difficult to get out to Staffa um, very early in the morning at sunrise or at sunset. So you're not going to get um, those golden hour photographs very easily out here without making some ridiculous arrangements with somebody to get onto this island. Um, it is unhammered. You can't stay, you can't stay out here at all. Um, there's nobody lives on this island. So you are relying on boats to get you backwards and forwards. And doing that in the, in the very early hours of the morning or late at night is, is difficult. But uh, yeah, so hopefully that image is, uh, is quite acceptable. If you've enjoyed this video, and I hope you have, um, then please do uh, give, us a, give us a thumbs up, leave some comments down below. And don't forget, down there in the corner, we've got a subscribe button. Hit that and uh, follow our channel in the future. Until next time, thank you very much for watching and we'll see you later.